Hi friends, it's Lisa Hetrick, illustrator for Gina K Designs, and I'm so grateful you could join me today. I have a brand new stamp set that I am going to share with you today called Choose Grace. And I've got a lot of inspiration to share, so let's go ahead and dive in and take a look at the new stamp set. So here she is, and this is something that's just a little bit different for me. It's got a little bit of a different whimsical flair. I've got lots of different elements in here. This really fun background, bamboo background, I've got in this stamp set some flowers and leafery, and I have this really fun vase or cup-like element um, for this stamp set. And lots of fun elements to build florals and backgrounds in this set. Okay, so I wanted to share a little bit about the inspiration for this set. Over the summer, last summer, I had painted this really fun kind of cup. And it was sort of like a teacup without a handle. And I was just painting some flowers in it. And when I finished it, I was like, mm, I think this would really be a fun stamp set. So... A couple months later, I ended up illustrating one um, that was inspired by this watercolor painting so you could create projects too. So let's take another dive into the stamp sets and I've separated all of the images so that I can talk through them. So here is that cup element. Now, it's super fun. You can use it for lots of different things. I've got some watercolor-like splatter. I've got this Choose Grace sentiment that fits really nice inside of the cup element. There's also that little swoosh on the G that makes it kind of fun. I've got this bamboo background, lots of whimsical leafery elements with some dot patterns in them just to kind of make it fun. Got some two-step stamping elements here with these wonky and whimsical flowers that are sort of like um, some line art images that could be like pansies. But you can see here that you can do two-step stamping and you can also do a little bit of wonky two-step stamping, which is my super fave. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the card samples. So this card is a ton of fun and I've used the cup element here to just kind of nest my floral and leafery elements inside. I'm loving the colors. I'm using some of Gina Case brand new color inks um, in this set. Now this, this example here is another fun one. Now the Choose Grace, I'm showing you how that that really interesting sentiment fits right inside that cup. I've got some of that wonky two-step stamping going and just kind of showing you how the leaves and the greenery just kind of set up nicely in that cup element. Now, here's another fun card. I've actually mishmashed this together with Arjita's new daisy set and I just kind of stamped that daisy inside of the open um, cup there and it's just super fun and I use that background as well. Here is another fun card where I've used the leafery elements and I've built a pattern with it to kind of create this pinwheel whimsical pinwheel pattern on the card and topped it off with a really fun sentiment called so so grateful for you. All right, I am loving this card. It actually got stuck to the one underneath it, but this is a really fun card too. I've got that pansy-like flower with some of that whimsical leafery. I've got that bamboo background and all the splatter elements on the base, the card base. And this is just a really whimsical card that came together really quickly. I'm loving it. And you know me and pattern making. So here is one of the elements in the stamp set that I just kept repeating in some of the two new colors from um, Gina K and just created that pinwheel look. Now this might be my favorite card. They're all my favorites and I just love them. But this is another um, card element where I've added something to the inside of the cup and just had a lot of fun with that splatter and those florals, just super fun and wonky. As always, my gift of grace to you is a free card idea sheet. The link is down below in the description. I've got eight fun card ideas that you can create with the Choose Grace stamp set or any other stamp set that you have in your stash. Just some really fun ideas. Um, I wanted to share with you. Thanks so much for joining me today for this little introduction of the Choose Grace stamp set. 
Choose Grace is available at GinaKDesigns.com right now. All of the links are down below in the description. And I hope you enjoyed this introduction today. And I'm so grateful for you. Thanks so much for watching. Please consider sharing the joy by liking this video and subscribing to this channel. And I'm sharing more card and watercolor tutorial videos for your inspiration right here. So come on in and take a peek at my tutorials. I have a lot to share and I'll see you next time.